Huh. Well, isn't this a pleasant surprise? I hadn't expected to run into you again. Indeed I am. The success of my previous venture, with which you so kindly assisted, has been brought to the attention of Mast. There is growing concern. Oh my. A bit of an unintentional pun, isn't that? Well, concern that things are going to get worse. The data we gathered points to a definitive trend. The vibrations coming from this tree are increasing in strength and frequency. Because we've never seen this before, not on this scale, we have absolutely no idea what the upper limit is. We don't know when or even if this will stop. It's imperceptible by normal human standards now, but given time. While I hesitate to speculate on the possibilities, well, none of them are good. Yes, and not just humans. All organic life will be affected. Low frequency vibrations are not uncommon in this species. The vibrations help disperse nutrients throughout the tree. However, normally the vibrations are imperceptible. If the vibrations continue to increase in frequency and strength, prolonged exposure could lead to harmful and potentially deadly side effects. It's imperative we find a way to correct this. There is data regarding other, younger members of the species. Unfortunately, there are some, shall we say, personal issues with acquiring it. <clears throat> per per personnel issues, if you understand me. Not necessarily, but if you're offering your services, you've certainly proven to be reliable help in the past. One of the other researchers in MAST, Enelio Hadek, has research I believe could be vital to my work here. He and I don't see eye to eye, and so far he's refused to turn it over to me. I'm hoping that if someone else were to ask, he might be more inclined to relinquish it. What do you say? Oh, thank you. Last I knew, he was on a field assignment somewhere near the outskirts of the city. Uh, perhaps it's best if you don't mention my name in the process? Working at the distribution center can be tiring. Mind your step. Important research happening here. <sighs> Could you stand a little to the left? I think you're blocking my readings. Trees? Uh, I see what's going on here. You're working with Kelton, aren't you? Nice try, but it's not happening. No. No way. Kelton is actively ruining my career. There's no chance that I'm helping him with anything. Whatever this thing is he's on about, he's just doing it to make himself look good with the higher-ups. I'm not helping him with that. <laughs> right. Of course, we're all in danger. Trees are involved, after all. Uh, he really won't let this go, will he? Hmm. Maybe I can make this work in my favor. Okay, you know what? I'll hand over the data. But I'm only going to do so after you've helped me secure a better position in MAST. Wait, really? Wow. Okay. Okay! I've gotten a few bad performance evaluations in the last couple of years. Totally unjustified. Incredibly unfair. I found a backdoor into the MAST network so I could make some changes to my personnel file. But it turns out the chief engineer knows what she's doing. The only way to get access is from the terminal in her apartment, which is kind of... locked. <laughs> Sorry, that's not on the table. There is, and I already explained exactly what it is. Advancing my career is the right thing to do, so that's what I'm focused on. I just want to make a name for myself, you know? I'm sure you can understand. Okay, look, look. Just hear me out, all right? I really need this to happen. If you do this for me, I can make it worth your while. 
You delete that data, I get promoted, I'm pulling in a bigger salary. I can compensate you. I'll throw in some extra credits for you, okay? A nice little bonus. But first, you need to get into the chief engineer's apartment. Fine, fine, you win. Just get out of my sight. And tell Kelton to stuff it. Hope you have the data. It's really quite crucial. That he is. I'm sorry that you had to put up with him, but this data is vital. I'm sorry if this was complicated. I'd prefer to remain unaware of the details in the event that it comes up later, particularly in a legal setting. And I suppose I'd better verify the data to make sure Emilio didn't double-cross me. But you have once again come through for me. I'm truly hoping that this is the last piece I need to figure out what we can do. And I appreciate it. Thank you for your assistance. <laughs>